Yes, ladies and gentlemen, we're in Vegas, and, and we got a Providence Vegas, Las Vegas story. Here's a fighter from, uh, he's from Providence, Rhode Island. Uh, actually, he's from East Providence, and he moved to, uh, moved, he's a fighting out of Providence, though. And uh, he's a great fighter. These are all these pictures. The guy's standing right beside me right now. For this is title. juggling taxi boxing news. He's gonna, you, are you fighting for a world title? Fighting for a world title in Newcastle, London, March. So I'm out here in Vegas. I'm gonna train, get uh -huh. ready for a fight. I'm fight in Thailand. I got nice. four fights there. Heavyweight championship fight in uh, London, and um, I'll hopefully come back home and bring Rhode Island home a heavyweight title. Right? Let me ask you something. If there's any young kids in Providence or uh, anywhere in the country, what advice you got to, to uh, give them? Um, relax. Advice? What advice? Advice, be, uh, advice for training wise? Don't be nervous. Don't be nervous. Don't be scared. Right? Know that there's there's nothing that can hold anyone back to try. If you never try, you're never gonna know. So if you if you think about something and you don't do it, you're gonna regret it. You gotta go for it. Okay. Best advice I could give someone. Is to get, just throw, do it. throw me some names in Providence, man. Some, <laughs> some fighters Providence in Providence. Mike the Machine Connors. Okay. We got 401MMA.com. Okay. Vinny Paz. We got this gym in Wall Street. Vinny Paz, man. One of, you know, one of the I best used to spot with Vinny He's a at his gym. Champ. He brought a heavyweight title to one of the All smallest Plainfield. states in, 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 in the USA. Right. You know, he, he's one of the best boxers around. We got Joey and, Spina. And, and Joey Spina, yeah. baby. <laughs> Joey I, Spina. That was my trainer. Larry Guglamedi yeah. used to train for Joey. We, uh, guy that was my trainer. God rest his soul. We yep. got... Um, Many, many people in Rhode Island that, you know, passed away recently. Yep, and, yep. Um, Remember Ralph Sinelli? He used to train me. Did he really? Yeah, Larry Guglometti and Ralph Sinelli. <laughs> Larry, yep. Um, Love Larry, right? Yep. I used to call him Gary, Uncle Larry, Gary right? Gary Tillenhouse is a very good um, Oh, fighter. how's he doing? Gary, I'm, he's a good I'm friend of mine. I he's he was a very, very good boxer. Oh, yeah. Is uh, he still fighting? Or he's what? not still fighting, no. Okay. No. Uh, okay, he stopped when I was out there. He's training people. He's okay. He's doing very good. We got um, Peter Manfredi. Peter Manfredo. Yeah, Peter Manfredo. How's Peter uh, doing? He's doing good. Um, I used to train. I used to train with his father. We got uh, Todd the Hulk Chattel representing Rhode Island right now. Nice. He's fighting. He's doing amazing. Okay. Um, he's fighting in for uh, um, Twin River, Rhode River. Rhode Island. Okay. He's doing uh, doing good things. He's fighting at 185 now. Nice. He, um, looking to get um, you know move up a little bit, maybe some, yeah. someday fight out here. Okay. But, uh, Besides that, you know, Rhode Island's small. We gotta, we gotta represent. It's hard to get opportunities when you. But get big them. people come out of Rhode Island. Big people. A lot of people, famous people, not just boxers. No, a lot, a lot of, of movie stars, people celebrities. People don't understand a little state, but it has a lot of back to it. Right, right. Yeah. Look yep. at um, um, Today Show. Uh, yeah. Right, yeah. right. Yeah. Man, he's from Rhode Island. Yeah, yeah. People don't realize that. I just almost say I'm from Boston because no one knows a Providence. Oh man, you got to keep huh? saying Providence, man. Providence. Keep saying Providence. Boston, keep representing. Providence, I, I do the same you know? thing out here because I, I get a lot of people out of the country, you know. Mm. I do the same thing with Providence, baby. I mean, I train in Holland. Vinny, Vinny always says Cranston. He never says Providence. No, Vinny Paz Cranston always says Island. Cranston, man. Cranston, always. Ever since I know him, he always says Cranston. He never says Providence. He always says Cranston. Yep. And you're, you're originally from East Providence. Originally from East Providence, Rhode Island. East Providence High or what? East Providence High School. Yep, okay. I sold for my whole life. Um, All right. Let me show, show me that fist, man. I was even tattoos on the fence yeah. too, man. I, I love wanna, it. I want to say, what's, what's 1981? Is that the one's birthday? A friend that um, passed away. Okay. Uh, I want to say thank you to Alistair and Valentine Overeem okay. for helping me out or giving me opportunities to train. Okay. Come to Holland and work out with them. Um, wow. Alistair is an unbelievable fighter. He just beat Brock Lesnar on the 30th at wow. the MGM Grand. His brother is Valentine is an amazing fighter as wow. well in Holland. Um, I'm just lucky to meet them and. Uh, Problems for Rhode Island is going to make a big, um, big splash. Impact in the world. Well, you're in Vegas now, man. You're, Vegas you're fighting now. in Vegas now. This you know? guy, he's Vegasy now, man. He's totally Vegasy. <laughs> Vegasy, man. Look, there's traveling, traveling taxi fighting news, man. How to Selassie. Ladies and gentlemen, we, you've seen it. This is Juggling Taxi News signing out. Thank you very much, my friend. 401 MMA.